Hello everyone, my name is Casey aka The Mega Miner, and welcome to the very first episode of Kingdom Builder. In this series, I'll be playing and exploring the new Minecraft 1.8 world while defending and upgrading our testificate town. After the first few episodes, I'll begin taking suggestions on what to add to the town through comments. It'll also be an opportunity for me to get certain quests done that I've never accomplished, like beat the Ender Dragon. So without further ado, here is Kingdom Builder. Alright guys, let's get straight into it. I was mulling it over in the back of my mind. Should we do a seed? Should we not do a seed? And I tossed around and thinking, well, maybe for the first five episodes we just wander around doing nothing and that's not really that interesting. So I figured, screw it, let's go with a seed. And this seed is actually pretty interesting if it works. We've got 666 as our seed. And now, if you know anything about the devil's number, this could end up turning our series really sour really quick, but uh, who cares, let's uh, try it out. Let's go season one, uh, what should we call it, uh, medieval, oh no, it runs out of space, okay, you know what, let's do periods, I suppose, kingdom builder, period, season one, period, medieval, perfect, alright, let's pray this works, because I've seen it on the Minecraft form, and I figured, hey, that's kind of interesting world name if you are scared away don't worry i'll uh, keep satan away from this minecraft village and uh, protect its people uh, you have to forgive the frame drops when we uh, spawn into the world because it's not the beefiest computer that i'm playing on so who knows i just hope that we end up Ooh, pretty nice okay i may go check the coordinates but i'm already liking whether or not we find the village or not where we are spawned in because look at that kind of like hovel that looks really interesting uh didn't i turn on bonus chest did i or did i not uh, oh yeah good thing okay no torches what is this crap whatever i at least want an axe okay we got some axe some twigs okay that was like a lame chest what the heck Okay, let's try and get up this uh, area and see if we can find that village. Because I gotta protect the villagers from the zombies, then we'll start breaking down their houses for resources, and we'll start mining, get everything in order, and then you guys can start piling in all your suggestions. And it should be a grand old time. I should probably start destroying these seeds. Where is this field? Again, I'm probably gonna have to go look up the coordinates. Uh, I'll destroy this block. Poor terrain. I wonder how high up we are right now. We're at 95? Gee dang. Okay, please be nearby. Let's knock down these seeds. Holy deuce, look at this beautiful valley. Of course, it might be the fact that it's my texture pack and the uh, grass colors change, so it'll probably look really different for a normal biome. As you can see, the tree color looks really different, but... Um, Okay, some nice cave openings, but let me go look at these coordinates, see if I can't find them, and then you'll probably see like a mega time lapse of me just walking on over there. So uh, let me check it out real quick. I should have pre-planned, pre but hey, this is the, uh, the thing with the stuff. Aha, there we are. Ooh, this is perfect. This is kind of just what I'm I was kind of envisioning and we've got caves nearby This is like the perfect setup. God bless the person that posted the oh wait the seed was 666 I mean, uh nothing of course. So uh, let's just get on to the village All right, we got some farms. This is definitely gonna be a fixer-upper type town. Oh Geez look what's going on and When it's an oh my good. Oh geez. Oh geez. Oh geez. Our first action of defense. Oh, there we go. Perfect. All right, you, you must forgive me, uh, of course, because the frames are a little odd. Oh, my goodness, this poor guy. Okay, that's kind of a crappy trade. Okay, we got some coal. All right, this is going to be... I don't even know where to start, practically. Okay, you know what? Hmm, yourself, you gypsy. Oh, jeez, how do we get out? Now we're trapped out here. This is like the trashiest village. All right, let's try and dig ourselves out first and get a survey of what's going on here this is not exactly what I had in mind the location is decent but the actual spawn is rather odd look like we have some chickens that'll be good I want it to kind of be nighttime already so I can lock everybody in their houses it's usually how I like to go about things paper 
It's kind of eh. Okay. Some wheat again. Worlds are spawning in, so it might take a little while. Maybe I can reduce the draw distance or whatever. Oh, sweet pumpkins? This place is like friggin' loaded. It's a little high off the ground. All right, definitely for sure. Okay, so let's get ourselves in order because we need to start getting some resources. I think we'll just start cannibal, oh, not cannibalizing, but scrapping their stuff for parts. Because why chop down trees when you can just destroy the farm that we'll get rid of anyway? Because look at this gorgeous flat line. We can make our own farm that'll serve me, the king. And I'll enslave the villagers. I'm just kidding. I care about people's rights or testificate rights. All right, I'm not sure how much wood we'll need. We kind of just need to waste the time of the day here so we can get all the villagers in order. I kind of want to get to save that, like, what was he, like the priest or the librarian? I'm not really familiar with all the different classes of the testificates. I want to go back into that cave and make sure the creeper doesn't sneak up on him and blow his brains out because that would make me sad. All right, uh, how many farms to cannibalize? I know because we'll probably end up destroying nearly every one of these houses so we can get our own designs in real quick. So I'm just leaving these here because I don't want them flooding. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? Oh, disrespect. 17. Okay, these guys are pretty awful trades so far. Is that reeds? Oh, well, let's pick up some reeds or at least start growing them. Not a bad idea. Can you notice how I get uh, sidetracked a lot? It's going to happen a lot in this series. Okay, grab some seeds. I think the fact that those flowers, when I destroy them, those are the fact that um, uh, my texture pack might be a little messed up. I'm not sure. There might be 1.8. Granted, we might run into a lot of bugs here as 1.9 is just out. Came out like three or four days ago. I'm not really sure. And there's a torch on the ground. Let's try and go save that guy as soon as possible. And then, oh my goodness, what is going on? Ah. Uh, it's like way more work than I wanted to do, to be quite honest. But hey, you know, no struggle, no gain, guys. So we're in it for the long haul this time. Okay, okay, yeah, exactly. See, I wonder if the guy's dead or if he ran away. Oh, jeez, dude. Oh, frick, 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 lag spike, or not lag. Okay, frames, oh, jeez. Again, I'm definitely going to have to work out the kinks here with uh, my computer. Okay, let's grab the coal, and then we'll light up this uh, friggin' cave, and maybe, like, block this guy in right where they... Is that an enderman? Holy crap, dude, you're dancing with death, man. Please don't do it, man. You have so much to live for. Okay, anyway. Let's get rid of the acacia wood. I don't really think it looks that great. Uh, maybe if I revert back to the savannah style that we have going on here, since my texture pack is essentially a lie. Um, you know what? Let's just scrap all this right away, because we're going to need a lot. Um, what was I saying? Ah, yes. So, would you shut up? Jeez, okay. I've had enough of your bull crap. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is the problem with the NPC villages. Maybe we'll have to go into the actual Minecraft files and turn them off because we might go completely psychopathic. Alright. Grab this coal, light this up, and then... What was I talking about? Ah, yes. The savannah. Like I was saying, we might revert back. It might look a little odd, but I think we can make this work. For sure. I'm already dropping down in health bars. I believe I saw some uh, ready carrots. So we'll probably grab those. And I think we should be set with food. We're definitely going to have to um, do some intensive work. I mean, like, we've got divots in the ground. I think we might just move people out into the fields. Um, and then we'll go off of that. I think that's probably the best course of action. I'm, like, getting pretty close to blowing my brains out over this stupid... Okay, I don't even know where he went now. Oh my gosh, now I can't even jump. It's kind of making me angry. Dude, are you over here? Dude, please tell me you're not in here. Okay. Okay, more resources, that's good. Okay, that is, we don't want to die on our first... I wouldn't say night, but first day. Oh, frick. Okay, you know what? Maybe we'll just let him explode. Come over this way, brah. Come on, explode, explode. Okay, that was good. Oh, jeez. Okay, I lost a little more health than I was hoping, but... Okay, there he is. Dude. Uh... It'd be kind of cool if somebody, like, made a mod. It probably already exists. Every time I say, oh, it'd be cool if they had this mod, it usually exists. If um, villagers could fight for themselves, of course, we have iron golems. We'll start to populate our kingdom with those eventually when we get an abundance of things. Now that we have some torch material, let's light up this place. 
So we can not get sneak attacks at night. The less zombies, the better. We're going to have to go upstairs in. And by upstairs, I mean above ground. And start torching up the place. Not that way, but like uh, lighting up the place. Because burning down our village would suck. And point being, don't want zombies to come on the first night. But what I usually do is let people go inside. And then we block off all the doors. And that works out pretty well. Some of the things I do might be off camera because a lot of it might just be really mundane and it'd be kind of boring to watch, but that'll probably come later down in the series when we need to like farm a lot of resources or things like that. I'll keep you guys updated on what I do, maybe record kind of time lapse kind of things. Okay, we're sitting on a coal mine. That's really nice. Of course, coal is so abundant and around. Oh my goodness, there's so many things to do. Like my mind is just so scattered right now. Right now, wasn't there a guy right here? There's that, like, dancing spastic guy. Okay, it's getting nighttime. Let's protect this guy. What should we block him in with? I guess, what is this, new stone? I'm not sure. Frick. <laughs> Andesite. I've played around with it a bit, but I don't honestly know very many of the names. I know I have a Minecraft channel. Don't keep up on Minecraft. Part of it is kind of like being a noob again. You know, you get to discover things all over again, and it's a lot of fun. Kind of need this cobblestone, but saving this guy's life is more important. Okay, try not to suffocate, dude. Don't think we'll go with the rotten flesh for our first meal. These guys are probably stuck too. Consider, oh, they can reach up here. Never mind. What? Oh, dude, what the heck? Okay, now he's running around like an absolute spaz. It's all right. You know, I'd be scared too if I could only talk with. That guy's going absolutely bonkers. Wonder if there's any houses even available. Yeah, that's probably why they're just bunching outside. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's start lighting the place up because it's getting dark. No zombies today. Huh. Huh. I have this friend, David, who can do the impressions pretty friggin' well. Me, I'm not really that great at it. Who knows, maybe I'll gain so much experience over the course of this entire Let's Play that I'll be a master at it. Okay, I wonder if we slapped on a door there. Oh, oh, perfect. What if we just take this door down, since they can't reach it? Oh no, oh no, oh no, one is dying. Do you hear that? Oh my gosh, you idiots, please, stop. You're killing yourselves. Please stop. Oh, oh my gosh. Please stop. 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 Get inside. Please. Stop throwing yourselves off the cliff. Oh my gosh. Should I just block them in? I mean, just like... Mm. Ah, villager problems. Holy deuce. Okay, everybody inside. Everybody inside the cave. Oh no. No, oh, this is absolute insanity. Okay, uh, gather materials. What do we do? Okay, they kind of like that hole right there, so let's block it off. I don't know. Let's make a shovel. Oh, so many things to do. Okay, let's run, 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 run. This is like absolute disaster. This is supposed to be impressive, and it's like not at all. Okay, there we go. Let's gather some dirt. If a creeper comes and blows this up, I'm just going to restart from the very beginning. <laughs> All right, everybody into the hovel. All right, let's trap them in. Nope, guys, please. It's either in or out. Okay. Got them in. Nope, not, no, get out of the way. No. Oh my goodness. This is so difficult. And we're not even done, and I'm about to starve. Dirt. Okay, is this fully sealed off? I hope this is fully sealed off. Almost. Okay, let's just take some zombie flesh just to make sure we don't activate starvation. Light it up a lot, and then we'll seal this puppy and come back to it later 
Hopefully this is enough to start the village. I mean, they all had bad trades, so like, uh, worst comes to worst, we just lose some crappy traders, so, well. I hear some skeletons rustling, so. If I get shot, though, it's probably certain death for me, so. Let's grab this and let's move out. Well, move on upstairs, grab some food, and then I think we can spend our first night. If I take down all those torches, I might be able to sleep away the night, and that would work out really well. It's getting a little hard to see now. I think this is a way out. Yeah. Okay, here we go. There's a spider. Jeez, I kind of want to go in third-person mode. Okay, okay, okay. Which one are which ones are ripe? I don't even think I want to replant them right now because too much danger. Okay, let's get these down. Think all is well now that we got that whole villager problem assessed. Just need a lot more light in the town. That would be something really nice. The only problem is it's not how Minecraft spawns them in. It's got to go over to this side. Pretty nice uh, walkway. <gasps> oh my goodness! Okay, I like uh, uh, anxiety issues. That's why you don't play Minecraft when your life is on the line and you only have two hearts left. Or how many did I have before that? I don't even know. Okay, we're out of torches. Creeper just blew up the town somewhat. I think we'll go with the option to sleep away the night. And then once I'm calm and collected, we can group back and start terraforming this place up. And we'll just start mining away all the houses that should start the groundwork for what's going on. This mound could work really well for my castle. And then we'll move all the villagers out there because they're my peasants. I don't even know why I'm clearing away the seeds. Now, what was I doing? Ah, yes. Getting away from the creepers. G dang it, G dang it, G dang it. Okay, why am I going this way? Oh, frick. I should have built a sword. I really apologize for the frames issues. Give me the cloth. No, no, no. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, 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 okay. We have the three cloth. We have the wood. Let's move our way to the house. Pray that all the villagers are safe. I mean, all of them grouped around there, so should be fine. Jeez, 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 jeez. Okay. We might wake up to a lovely creeper near us, but, you know, all's well that ends well. Okay, let's get these carrots. Munch on down. Gotta make sure we have some to replant with. I don't think that should be a problem. Okay. And there we are. Get a crafting table down. Maybe put down a chest too. I don't want to put all my stuff in here yet though because this will definitely be one of the first houses to go because it looks so trashy. And how did I not get that third block of wool? Okay. I hate my life. Let's go. Good thing we have full hunger now. Did I leave it back over here? There it is. Okay, let's go back. Should be fine and made it no problem. Okay. Now we'll get the bed down. And tomorrow begins the rest of our adventure after my scatterbrain first day. And half of the world is gone. Good night. Hi everyone, thanks for watching my video. Don't forget you can hit the subscribe button to never miss another video. You can also click on the middle image that's going on right now and you can watch the previous video I put out or you can click on the images on the left to watch the playlist of those series. Also click the arrow on the right and you can move on to the next video. Don't forget you can follow me on Twitter or leave a like or a comment below and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.